Good morning. Happy Friday. Dr. Jared here with the Friday Flop. And today's Friday Flop is from actually the case I sh shared with you yesterday with Q&A with Dr. J. And here you can see my final PA from that case. We did a MTA direct pulp cap and you can see excess glass ionomer material. What happened in this case was I had the ram on and I couldn't fit a de novo band around the tooth at the same time. So after I put my calcium silicate, I condensed glass ionomer in and some of that went below contact. So when I took the rubber dam off and finished placing a, a core buildup with the resin modified glass ionomer, I already had had the flash in there and wedging wasn't going to make a difference. So in the future, I'm going to be placing probably something on the, if I have a rubber dam on and I can't get a thing uh, on, and that's the case I'm going to be doing, I'll place something on the adjacent tooth and build a wedge from there so we can uh, keep that excess material from being below contact. This should be easy fix to scale off since it's just 